Jones. Oh, what got whacked? This is Saturday Morning Maintenance, and today's project is we're going to install a LED light in the Road Blasters marquee. This game is actually a working Road Blasters, and we're going to do a restoration physically on it, but we have the control panel is a really nice control panel. This game is actually all original. You can see it's got the original Atari System 1 artwork on it, which I've started to peel off because I'm actually going to put new side art on. I've actually was able to get the PCB working, which it just needed to have the ROMs reseated, which is huge. That doesn't always happen, but a blessing in disguise. This is the actual original Road Blasters marquee. It's actually kind of a, a little bit of a mess. It's cracked a little bit at the corner. And it's, it's not faded, but it's really dirty. So let's get our tools out and uh, let's get started. You can never have enough tools. So on this ballast right here is also a, looks like there is a ground. I've totally fallen in love with the Atari System 1 cabinets. Um, I love the design. You can literally access the MPU and the cartridge board from the front panel, along with the power and everything else. The speakers are just above the control panel. And some of the games that were created, you have Road Blasters, of course, Marble Madness, Peter Packrat, Indiana Jones in the Temple of Doom. Uh, let me think of some other ones. There's a couple more, but what a wonderful a system that Atari came up with. It would have been cool to see other games come out on this. Let's see, so we were able to get the main fixture part out and we have the ballast to get out and we also have to get the we have to get the fuse holder, the fuse case holder out. Look at that wicko. Check that out everybody. Check it out. Check it out. I'm going to use my trusty, um, I've got a shark vac. I got a shark vac that I used to clean, clean out my games with. It's kind of cool. So I can just, it's really a really nice option here. Right now, I'm going to take the original wiring harness right here. And I've also got, this is the wiring harness that came with the, the LED light. I'm going to actually modify this light by cutting off this cord and attaching it to this, uh, the white and black I'm going to cut off the end that's got the plug and then I'm going to create I'm going to create a I'm going to split these a little here like I said I'm just kind of biting at them here a little bit that way I can get a good there we go all right we're making progress. So now we're sitting there in a good place with this. So now it's actually the original wiring harness is like right here. So what I'm going to do is I am going to, I will show you before I put it in. So basically, like I said, this is cool because this connector here this connector here goes right into, as you can see, let me see if you can see that. So this connector goes right into this like this. It's a really cool connection. Really good stuff. Easy, easy connection. 
I tell you, these are really a great way to go for arcade lights. That's solid. There we go. Solid, very solid. Okay. There we go. Okay. So, let me um let me move the camera here. Yep. So check it out. That you can see the harness goes right in the light right there and it's really clean install. I'm going to take you around the back and show you. Let's go around the back here. All right, so I'm at the back of the game. And like I said, you can see right here the connector and the original harness is intact. So I'm just going to pop this harness together and the light is actually ready. I did create a ground right there based on the wiring harness. So it, it is grounded and right now I am going to fire up the game and show you how cool the light is. Let's see if we got a working light. Ha! We do! How about that? Sweet! That's good looking. Nice. Very nice. So once we put, once we put the Road Blasters marquee on, that's cool, man. That is really cool. Real cool. Hey, that looks good. So let's see what I do with the glass. That is a clean, 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 clean looking Road Blasters marquee. I'm going to shut the lights off just for a second so you can see just what this looks like. How sweet is that? Sweetness. All right, if you're looking to upgrade your marquee light to an LED solution, I highly recommend the General Electric Longer Life Energy Efficient version. You can get these at Home Depot and I'm sure Amazon or other locations sell these. Also, they have a kit where you can get a linkable direct wire converter. What a great upgrade. Every time I do a restore, I'm gonna do this option. I wonder if they're still giving away this t-shirt. <laughs> road blasters. All right, let's fire up some road blasters. I've got this game set on free play. I actually installed a, a better monitor in the System 1 cabinet. It looks stunning. So right now, we're going to fire up some road blasters. And I'm going to demonstrate some road blasting action. So I'm going to start... I'm going to start right there with the forest sector. You can kind of select your... Hit the button, the trigger button. We got the accelerator, foot pedal, and we got the weapons. So this is the main weapon. And you can get those little green things for fuel right here. Oh yeah. I don't think I'm that good at this game. If you can see the, right below here, you got the nitro injector. You can see it tells you how many you have left. I think you get three of them. Here we go. And you hit to activate your special weapons you hit these top thumb trigger firing buttons this game's addicting I would call this like a a spy hunter slash pole position hybrid it's a total blast another special weapon this one this is the Uzi cannon it shows you there's a gauge right there that shows you how much firepower you have left with your special weapon I'm out oh like a whacked this game also retains high scores so it's actually really fun to go after high score saves are a muscle for my games in Arcade Hollywood so. 
Oh, you get the, the red, the red orbs give you fuel, so do the green orbs. There we go. I made it past the rally five status. Let's see, here we go. Yeah, I think a lot of people disregard this game, but it is, it's a blast. This will be a lot of fun to, to actually do a, a stream on. Yes. I'm going to I'm going to start doing some uh, direct capture streams once I get the darn barn fixed. Road blasters. The red orbs don't don't move as fast as the green ones. You have to actually accelerate. Well, not accelerate. You have to actually get there. So we're doing good. All you road blasters out there. There's a variety of enemies in this game. Um, those blue cars... I, I haven't destroyed those blue cars yet with the regular weapons. This here is a cruise missile. This will like, ooh crap. Oh, I lost my special weapon once. If you get hit or destroyed, you lose your special weapon, so. Oh. There's a checkpoint there that actually re refuels your tank. There's a couple ways to get gas from your vehicle. See those green orbs? The green orbs. There's a red orb. Oh, whack out. I love the special weapons uh, vehicle up there. Oh, I'm in trouble. Let's, let's see if I can get some gas. Ah, uh, it's over. So this game is awesome because it has a high score save option baked into the motherboard. Bam! My high score so far is 209,000. Alright, that is Road Blasters! Alright, I hope you enjoyed this episode of Arcade Hollywood. Here's a shameless plug. Check out the Pinball Expo website at www. Dot pinballexpo.com. This year's show will be October 16th through the 19th, 2019 at the Weston Wheeling, Illinois. Once again, want to give a huge shout out to my good friend Mike Miller and his band Origami for providing me with all the amazing music for this channel. You can check him out at origami.tumblr.com. Coming soon, we will have the Fried Popeye episode the Vector VGA Tempest Conversion, the Barncade video series, and more arcade and pinball fun. Don't forget, you can check me out on Twitter, Arcade Hollywood at Hollywood Arcade. We are also out there on Facebook and Twitch. Please email me with any comments or questions at discohollywood1 at gmail.com. All right, this does it for another episode of Arcade Hollywood. Please like and subscribe.